We, we do understand what you're saying. Na ang importante talaga rito is uh, uh, yung, for example, yung hospitalization rate and uh, how much yung pag increase on. But at the same time, uh, uh, if we do see an increase, and, and it is a significant increase if that happens, uh, uh, from 1,800 1, to 18,000, I think 1,800 is now the daily uh, uh, seven day average. Uh, that's really big, and that I suppose would would mean an increased risk for the vulnerable population uh, who 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 still are, of course, with us. Kait ni tayo kasama don, o hindi kami kasama don. We are increasing the risk for them. Uh, yes, uh, understand. We understand that. No, that hesitation, uh, that fear. Uh, pero kailangan din isipin natin, uh, and always DOH will remind everybody. Uh, that it, is, it boils down right now to informed choices and informed decisions. Mm. People has to assess their risk. Kailan ba sila dapat magtanggal ng mask? Kailan ba dapat na hindi ka nagtatanggal ng mask? Uh, we have seen the behavior of Filipinos from uh, comparing from the start of the pandemic up until now. Uh, there is already learned behavior for using this mask. So even though during the time that we have uh, implemented the uh, voluntary masking outdoors, we can see almost around 50 to 60 percent of Filipinos still opts to wear their mask even outdoors kahit na nga walang tao, nakamask sila. So we are relying on that and communicating this to them even every day just to remind people uh, that they need to know their risk before they decide if they will remove their mask or not. What about in churches, you say? Uh, are you encouraging or required for yung indoor masking? Well, that's an indoor area and therefore uh, voluntary po ngayon ang pagsusuot ng mask. But as I've said again, we are emphasizing na kapag ikaw ay matanda, please wear your mask. Kapag ikaw ay may mga comorbidities, please wear your mask even though you're indoors and the masking is voluntary already. Halabas kaya yung executive order for the indoor masking before UNDAS, are we expecting that? Wala pa kasi. Oh, well, uh, we are expecting because during the time that we had our discussions in the cabinet, uh, urgent measure siya, no? So the president committed that the executive order will be issued. Uh, so uh, sa tingin ko naman, lalabas siya in the coming days.